Hey guys, happy Friday. I hope you had a good week. Um, I want to apologize for the lack of a weekend vlog from last weekend. Um, but if you follow me on Instagram, which if you don't, you should, I'll put it in here. Um, we went up to Ethan's parents' house. I did start filming a vlog. Um, and on Saturday, we ended up putting down one of Ethan's parents' dogs, Harry. Um, he had cancer and they knew that that was coming but it just kind of happened really quickly on Saturday and as you can imagine I just didn't feel like vlogging so no weekend vlog from last weekend so this week wasn't the greatest I was pretty sad he was just he was such a sweet boy and he actually like followed I think, can't remember who was walking their other dog Ginny but he like followed them home. We don't know where he came from. Um, they like took him to the vet and everything, like tried to find his owners and never found him. So Ethan's parents gave him a good home um, for seven, seven and a half years about. Um, but it, he, he wasn't like, it took a long time for the diagnosis to come through and he was like doing okay, but he was kind of going downhill. And then Saturday was, just not good so um but he's not in pain or uncomfortable anymore and we will miss him very much so um that's kind of a downer to start on but um and then this weekend we were supposed to go away for the weekend with my cousin and her husband and my other cousin her brother and his girlfriend um but that has been postponed um so I don't know if we're gonna go we're gonna reschedule it for another point in the summer I think um, so we're home this weekend Ethan and I are going for dinner because by Monday I was like I need something like I just need something happy um, so we're going in about an hour so we're probably leaving in a half hour we're going to milestones um, and then tomorrow we have uh, one of Ethan's cousins birthday parties which we weren't going to be able to go to because we were going to be away but now because we're here we're able to go to that so we're going to go to that tomorrow um, kind of like afternoon and evening and then we don't really have any plans for Sunday we might drive out to see our house and maybe go for a hike if it's nice I don't think it's supposed to be very nice this weekend but um, that is what's going on so I will show you dinner and those are my 80 day obsession trackers. I finish it tomorrow. So this is like a preemptive celebratory dinner. And also cause just, I needed something to look forward to, but I said, this is a pre celebratory 80 day obsession finishing dinner. There's Ethan. Ethan, you're walking away. Sure am. and we have um, suitcases in here those big boxes we got my dad a suitcase or contributed to a new suitcases for him for Father's Day so but yeah that's what's going on and I will catch up with you guys at dinner also the Raptors won last night so it's kind of interesting to see so I stayed up <laughs> I thought it was a jinx for the longest time but stayed up and they won we are the champions and it's been really cool to see like that it's not just like a town or a city that's excited about this like it's all of Canada so go Canada go Raptors I'm glad they did it yeah this is a Mediterranean goat cheese platter there's garlic and goat cheese and that's like a fig jam or something. Ethan's got a beer. I have margarita. It's like flashing. Good morning. It is a 10.04. I've been up for about two hours. Um, had coffee, ate breakfast, and we watched uh, the first episode of Chernobyl last night. So we watched the second one this morning. Um... But I'm about to do day 80 of the 80 day obsession. So let's go. I look a lot different, but I'm done. I did it. So now I'm going to do it again. <laughs> 
So I will do a, just like I did with the 21 day fix, I will do like a my experience with the 80 day obsession. Um, I might film it like next weekend. I have it scheduled, I can't remember for when, so I will let you guys know once that is up. But I just want to like have time to like get all my thoughts together and everything like that. But I'm doing it again, so obviously you can take what you want from that. Um, but yeah, so it feels good to be done. And now I'm all ready to go. So I don't think the party starts until like three, so it's almost 12 now. So um, we might run around a little bit and I'm gonna show you my outfit one second. This is what I think I might be wearing. I don't know how cold it is outside. So the shirt is from Pixie Lee & Co. And I've had it for a long time. And I was like, oh, should I wait to wear it until we go? But that's not for a while. So I figured I might as well get use out of it. And then these are the denim shorts. One pair that I bought a couple weeks ago. I feel like I'm just not used to wearing shorts. This short, even though like they're not that short but <laughs> just gotta get used to it but yeah i'm debating i need to get a new passport because i've changed my name so i might get that taken because you know got full face makeup and i might film a video today i don't know it depends worked hard this morning already so we'll see <laughs> hey guys it is sunday afternoon <laughs> Um, I don't think I've vlogged since yesterday, so we went to Ethan's aunt and uncle's house, that was fun. Got home around 9, and then we watched another episode of Chernobyl before bed, and then this morning we got up and we drove out to where our house is to see what's going on there, and then went back to Ethan's aunt and uncle's for breakfast, and we got some donuts. They were really good. Then we went to do the produce shopping and are now home. Um, I'd like to film a video today if possible. And Alex and I are hanging out now. We're gonna watch, there's this chef show on Netflix, which has Jon Favreau. I don't even know really what it's like, so we're gonna try watching that. And then we might play, play Battleship. Cause that sounds fun. And we, what else did we watch, Alex? We watched the Jonas Brothers on Jimmy Fallon. So that was fun. And we're gonna make some sticky sesame cauliflower this afternoon. But that's what's going on, right? Yeah, so that's what we're doing. We're playing Battleship. Here's what my board looks like. And we're listening to Lines, Vines, and Trying Times because it came out 10 years ago today. Alex and mom are on a team. Here you wanna show her board and then you can press the red button to stop recording and I will not look at the footage <laughs> but I'll be editing and I'll be like oh man there. it is 5 33 and I'm sitting out on the deck Ethan's doing a um, course at like a local university and so I'm editing his project we played Battleship and Alex won. She, I couldn't find her patrol boat, the, the one that was two, I couldn't find that one. But I was one off, I was very close. And then we played like Guess Who? And I had narrowed it down to her person and the next time it was my turn, I was gonna guess who she was. And my mom was helping her and was like, well, like she's she's got your person, you should just like make a guess to see who you think she is. She freaking guessed it. So. And then she uh, typed on her computer, up yours too. Like, I don't think she meant it as up yours, but we were like, Alex, you said up yours. Like, what? It was really funny. So. But yeah, so I think I'm gonna make cauliflower for dinner. And we ended up watching the movie Chef because Alex hadn't seen the movie. And then now there's the show on Netflix. So once we watched the movie, then she understood that it was based on the show. So, and Ethan's been out here all afternoon working on this paper. So, yeah, Ethan, Ethan, I'm filming you. Well, get down from there then. 
<laughs> Ethan did leg day yesterday. It is about 7.45 and we just finished dinner. That sesame, sticky sesame cauliflower is very good. I will leave a recipe below. Um, but I think I'm going to finish the weekend vlog for this week. So I hope you enjoyed it. I feel like I didn't film a lot, but sometimes just not that talkative. Um, this week's vlog post on Wednesday is my like bridal look. So I go through like all of my accessories and everything including like my dress and shoes, earrings, necklace, veil, everything like that um, because I definitely splurged on some things but also was very cost effective or cost conscious on some things um, so check that out if you're interested and then tomorrow the day after this goes up I am sharing a skincare update so um, if I'm still using Drunk Elephant products um, and yeah, so make sure to check those out if you haven't already. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe for more. And I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching.